Hi. Right, I'm making this video simply because it, you know, of the the amount of pain, heart, heartache, heartbreak, just frustration it caused me. Trying to sort of set up the snap bridge to connect with me, um, D fifty six hundred. It was just an absolute ball ache. So many tears have I've cried, and I've let I've let uh, Nick on Nikon know about it. But let me let me just try and get to the point here. Let me try and do it as fast as possible. Right. Obviously, you've got the the snap bridge app that you've downloaded from either the Apple Store or the Google Store, and I'm presuming here that you've got actually got a camera as well to uh, connected to so you're looking at this this is the app let me just get out of this you can see that um and let's get on to this you've got a camera here switch it on uh you've got a screen there now it'll be, obviously it'll be might be a little bit different for your your camera Get on. Roy. Alright. Get it on. Get this, there's a, there's some, a couple of sunflowers there. Press the menu button. Right. What you want, right. And it's it's quite... Maybe I've got it set up to come on this setting. But the easiest way I can think of doing it is just... Getting on that Wi-Fi button there. Select it. Don't bother with the Bluetooth. Unless, obviously, you need the Bluetooth connection to pair your device, to pair your phone uh, to your camera. But once you've done that, uh, literally just go to Wi-Fi, establish connection. Because this has to be, this, it's so fussy, this this app. You know, it's just so, like, delicate and fragile. Um, then you come up, comes connect to the follower network. So you're going to look on your, back on your phone now. Let me switch over to um, get off this. <laughs> And get back on to this. Let's look in here. Ah, here we go. Available networks. Let's click on this one here. Uh, connecting. Shouldn't take too long. All right, checking the quality of your internet. In the meantime, I guess you can sort of... Um, oh, that's a good sign. When it comes up with some sort of notification, it generally means that it's made a connection. I'll go over to the SnapBridge um, app. Right, I'm waiting for the other options to, to light up, like download pictures or remote photography, but it's not it's not happening. It's not working. And if I go back on to my um you know looking at the phone the, the camera itself. Let me just check. Um let me see. According to this. Oh, according to me, camera. The connection's actually live. It it's the connection's um it's connected, it seems. Do you know what I mean? Close Wi Fi connection, that's my option. Well I haven't got I haven't got one open th thanks. So uh what's going on here? And recently I just um figured out that it's simply a matter of closing your uh, VPN. Disconnect your VPN for a bit, half an hour. And then we'll go back and try the same thing again. I'm going to... Actually, before that, I'm going to go back to my camera. I want to close this connection. Get closed. And then I'll establish it again. Let's have a redo, eh? Let's have a redo. All right. Connect to the follower network from your smart device's Wi-Fi settings. Let us commence with the... Proceed with the... With those instructions and um so we'll go into the uh our wi-fi settings here have a little search there you go available networks we'll try again come on you little sod connect hopefully right this is good this is good well it's not bad right this is good current network so we're officially on but I'm waiting for that notification. And as soon as that notification comes on, right, I'm off. Don't touch anything. Just go straight back and just wait. Oh, bingo. Download me pictures. 
lovely pictures of sunflowers. Oh yes. Oh yes, look at those lovely sunflowers. Let me get you on my phone. Gorgeous. Right, and that's basically it. So uh, I'll leave it there actually.